2020, the players of the Indomitable Lions of Cameroon, who played the 1990 World Cup in Italy, were compensated with houses. These houses had been allocated to them immediately after the return from the World Cup competition. It took so long, but it happened. There is one question we are asking today. Was the death of captain of that team, Stephen Tattle, connected to the final allocation of the house? Was there any other impact on this decision for the players to be given the house? We will follow on an azure in this episode and we will get the genesis of this story how the houses were given out to them. When we were back from Italy, uh, early July 1990, and then we got messages, we got information that uh, the head of state has awarded us uh, houses from our game in uh, the result we, we, we got in Italy. So I was... Uh, Myself and Ebuele took the uh, because everybody was not in Cameroon. So after the the the, 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 the World Cup and uh, all that went after the World Cup, everybody went back to the club. So I was still playing in Cameroon with uh, Bertin, and the, the group asked us to to follow up the the things to see what will happen because every each, each of them has already. Uh, been asked where anybody would like to have, to the, have a house. The house. Yes. So that time, Sik was in Yaoundé, Douala, and few other cities. Okay. So we were asked to choose where we wanted to get a house. So we followed up the, the, the flight from July to October, November, but it was just. Uh, there was no result. No result. Like uh, shedding, sh uh, how, how you call it? Uh, shedding sh uh, shadows. Like you are, you are chasing a shadow. Yeah, just like that. We got to see the the head of the sick, uh, so still where you come from, and he said that you have the houses, but we just need to know the meaning of indomitable lions, and then we could not understand why we think we are the indomitable lions. How come you ask us what means indomitable lions? But we got to know after that that um, from the 22 players, good, we there was there were some other names, some other names, okay, up to 43 or 47. 44. I don't really remember. Mm -hmm. really remember, and that could uh, could not match the expectation of the head of state. Okay. We wanted to give a few houses, houses. for the players, and eventually the coaches for the coaches and. Uh, the people really close to the close team, to the team to the team, so, and then for 20 years we didn't talk about that much. So when we celebrate the, the 30 30th anniversary of the, the, the of the event, yes, because of due people, journalists started to ask about uh, the prestation, about blah 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 blah, and we had a meeting with uh, other members of what we call Caliph, Caliph. the association of former Indomitable Lions. Now we are talking about 2020 now. Yeah, now we're... Wait, after you had the celebration. Yeah. Then you, 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 your members of uh, the association of uh, players now said, okay, let's, let's go over it again. Yeah, because during 28 years, we yes. didn't talk about the houses. Okay. So we just recall that, uh, that uh, promise in 2020. Okay. Because, uh, okay, with the... All people coming back to what happened in 1990, how far they were, blah, 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 blah. And then we say, Ebuele, the, the head of the Caliph, Caliph. asks, okay, Jules, I think this is the time now to, to ask if that thing really exists. And then we set up a plan, what we could do Correct. to go to the, to the head of state head of and state. remind him that something were... It was not going right. Yeah. Okay, so we wrote a letter to the head of state, through the Minister of Sports, 
and then we wrote the an, another one through the DCC. Yes. So two letters. The director of cabinet. Yes. Okay. So two letters went to the head of state, and uh, two three weeks after, we got an answer from uh, the minister of sport, Mr. Molekombi, who said, "Okay, uh, I got your letter. I forward it to the boss. We are just expecting any news." as soon as possible. Okay. We thank the minister because he was very, very quick in this, to take actions. And uh, less than one month and a half, we got the answer that they was uh, busy at school. Yes. And then uh, I got a phone call from uh, Mila. Okay. We just said, okay, Jules, we need to, you need to come and meet me. What are the, uh, it was a, in a meeting with the Olympic Committee. Okay. Yeah. He said, meet me. We have to go to the director of uh, SIC. Good news are uh, coming. We got the houses. I said, oh, okay, I'll follow you. And then we fixed the meeting at 4 p.m. that day at the end of the, 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 the director of, uh, of SIC. Okay. And he said, I just received a letter from the head of state in response of your letter you sent and then okay uh, we are you have you got the houses already this is the letter so now it depends on you when we can have that meeting to set everything up and uh, set up the ceremony and everything for you to get the key of the, the key. houses it all took i don't know less than two months from June, Something from which June. in from 1990 yeah, yeah. had never been affected. Never, never, never. So that's why we were very thankful to the, the minister and uh, the Mindy. This is the Ketcha Cortez. Okay. We're very, very fast, fast in to, treating the yeah. documents. Yeah. Yes, and the day Miller called you and you informed the others, how did they feel? Very happy. Surprised. And some didn't believe that uh, we got rid of the houses. <laughs> I have to convince them that uh, we did it, and now to try to explain the process. Okay. Because uh, Ebuele asked me to do it. Roger Miller was uh, is there. The yeah, new, following up yeah. and giving advice. But the, the others didn't know what we are doing, and uh, I had to explain to them that we started on June, blah 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 blah, and then we have it. So they say okay. Please go on, and uh, we hope that this time will be for real. For, for real, and then when we fixed everything with uh, the manager of the sick, when we fixed the day, the date, the day to receive, to the, receive the, houses. The, 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 the keys, the keys of yeah. the houses, and say, oh, so that thing is real. <laughs> it is real. <laughs> for those who still were still abroad, I abroad, know. They, they send the wives, the, 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 the children for Booth and his daughter, Mr. Fenba and his wife, uh, Mkono sent representative. So everybody was was, was well represented. Yeah, that day. So the, 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 the little thing that was worrying a few people, anyway, for Tato, he had died, but his family was there. Mm -hmm. um, uh, for Massing and Fede, how did you, de how did you, did that decision come? The people who came, were they sent by their families? The representatives yeah. who came and got the keys on Fede mm -hmm. and uh, Massing. Okay, uh, Massing, uh, his eldest son was there. Okay. Yeah, he was uh, called because he already had uh, all the documents to represent the late uh, father. Father. Uh, we had, uh, even for Tato, just passed away that time, and uh, there's, there were no problem because the daughter was there, the son was there. Uh, we knew the situation of the family. That's right. So we talked to the minister, to the, the manager of SIC. SIC. And, uh, okay, because we knew the two children. Children. Of, uh, Stephen, no problem. And uh, we had it. a family. Yes. Uh, Emmanuel, Tato Emmanuel Tato, yes. First to round up everything. Okay. There were no problem. Okay. The problem with uh, Fede, uh, he got married three times. Okay. And, uh, from each wife, he got children. So that was a little bit difficult to bring all of them to together. All of them together because there were so many problems since they passed away. But we tried to 
help them fix the problem okay. by talking to the minister, okay. uh, Mr. Mrs. Ketchakotes. You know, when she was the head, uh, the boss of Pante Bangante, Bangante. Yeah, Fede was uh, coaching at uh, Bangante. Bangante. So, so she knew quite the, well the family. The, the family well. Yeah. So she helped us to call everybody, the three wives, all the kids. We had a meeting at um, her office and we had a memorandum, we had a PV. And so every, everybody was settled before. Every, everything was settled before the, 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 the date of the, the end of, of, of the keys. Okay. But the day of the end of us, there is there, there was there, there were one little bit uh, misunderstanding. Okay. Because from the minister, who got a letter from uh, one of the wives, uh, didn't cross check with the, his minister. So when they hand over the keys to the others. Uh, didn't didn't call uh, for the family to give back the, to give the keys. Yes. And then we protest because everything had been set up set before. It. Correct. So after that, if you remember the, the ceremony, they call for the family after uh, everybody, and then you saw all the children of Fede there exactly. at that time. Yeah. So they hand over the keys to the the, the, the elder of, of uh, the children, and then okay, now everything is in process. For us to sign the contract and uh, all the separate necessary paperwork, yes. Everything, yeah. Yeah.